All right. Hi, my name is Robert Campbell. My project's called Hole in the Wall, and it's dedicated to educating the college community on how they can impact the local community. America is currently in its worst recession. Since 2008, America has been in its worst recession since the Great Depression. Corporations such as... some reason it clicked out. Oh, wow. Start over. No, no, okay. that's all right. We can, yeah. We're ahead. We can so. follow in you. Yeah. I'm actually, I'm just going off talking, trying to be fluid. Yeah, I'm not trying to. Yeah. So. You don't want to interrupt your flow. <laughs> there you go. Just, just use it. Okay, yeah, that's better for me. <laughs> you can start. Hi, my name is Robert Campbell. My project is called Hole in the Wall, and it's dedicated to educating the college community on how they can impact their local communities. Since 2008, America has been in its worst recession since the Great Depression. Corporations such as Walmart kill our local communities, outsourcing, mass producing, outsourcing, mass producing, and even dri driving down prices. Also, a lot of their employees are so poor that they have to seek aid from our own government. From my experience at UMass Lowell, I've, oh, oh sorry, once, um, illicit trade has also been a massive issue since the 1990s. You know, maybe you're buying a baseball glove or a handbag, but in another part of the world, you could be supporting drugs or gun warfare. From my experience at UMass Lowell, none of the, most students really don't know about our community right across the bridge. They don't understand that there's a student, student driven prices right across that bridge right there. And from my work with the downtown businesses, I've also come to understand they really just don't know how to unify. A lot of them find city council to be completely hypocritical. And there are just certain problems that are, there are certain issues that are good for businesses but bad for others. And they really just have no form of all around organization. I'm currently a full time student at UMass Lowell. I'm also an intern at the Merrimack Valley Small Business Center. Last semester, I was mentored by former community director Stacy Hargis. I've also been working on South Campus with Mr. Paul Marion, who has helped me with a lot of my current projects. I've recently received support from the Chamber of Commerce for my pitch, and I was also the manager of the Shop Local Campaign for Lowell last fall, which I did prove brought local stimulation to the area. Economic stimulation. From right now until my new 2000 campaign this fall, I want to be educating students through my projects and tours and getting them downtown. From that, on my campaign last year, I released a survey which I recorded in SurveyMonkey. So this year I want to release another survey which will statistically prove that students made a significant positive impact on our city of Lowell. I'd like to continually run this in Lowell while expanding to other colleges such as Daniel Webster or even the University of Southern Maine, continually running programs in the communities. I also, through networking, have other colleges around the country I can stay at for free without paying for housing and work on site personally with those cities. I like to, sorry about that. As a nonprofit, I receive my funds through city grants, sponsorships, as well as donations. I'd also like to form a website which would highlight the colleges participating the local resources around them, and the charities they give back to. Anything I missed? All right. Ultimately, I'd like to just educate college kids how they can impact their communities, the economic stimulation they can bring, how, it can, how the communities are the ones to give back to charities, and supply jobs. I'd like, to I'd like to establish more efficient generations who are more cultured by the different ideas that these jobs bring. And even to go as far as to say that maybe, if it ever worked in the future, maybe you know politicians they are going right through our communities and having to seek the advice from people because of the people shopping small. Because I would be traveling around the country, there were, will be a cost. I would like two thousand for airplane tickets, possibly, as of right now, or or just driving gas. Um, I have a basic website, but I look, would like a much more advanced website. Um, in case I want to increase my marketing materials, would be another thousand. Then the last thousand, when I say emergency, that's miscellaneous. You know, maybe you were on site somewhere, and then we have a family emergency down, home, you know, back home, or maybe there's something that's a flat tire, or maybe we, you know, we do feel we need an extra two hundred to work in the city right now. It's just what that's there for. So, uh, thank you.